been making music for two decades. And after leaving the industry in 2015, he's back with his new single, Love Me With The Lights On. Please welcome Sean Desmond. <laughs> For you, I'm so excited that you're here. I'm so excited. When they told me I was going to be doing this, I was like, yes! <laughs> I love it. I am so thrilled. Honestly, though, singer, songwriter, dancer, choreographer, is there anything that you don't do, though? Uh, what I don't, I don't cook so good. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, so are we the perfect pair? I boil pair? a mean pasta, though. Honestly, that's actually uh, trickier than you think. Right? Yeah. Okay, okay. I feel like you're good. I don't feel as bad now. No. Uh, <laughs> So you've got so many hit songs. Mm -hmm. Personal fave, Let's Go, so great. Oh my gosh. Oh, I sing it you. all the time. Oh they can God. attest to it. What is um, your favorite Sean Desmond song? My favorite Sean Desmond song. That's, they're all my babies. Yeah. It's so hard to pick just one. Um, I love Love Me With The Lights On. This uh -huh. new one is so special to me. Not just because it's a great song, but it also has a, a really deeper meaning yeah. for me. Um, but also Night Like This. Oh my gosh, what a, uh, what a classic, yeah. Um, shiver. Oh my gosh, so uh, love good. Love Shiver, uh, Shook. Oh my God, this girl thing amazing. Wow, yeah. Mary No. <laughs> I love it. That's amazing. So you, after seven year hiatus, mm. are coming back. Mm -hmm. what, I'm back. You are back. I'm back. What was it like? What brought you back in? There was, I think, a phone call that happened? Yeah, yeah. so I get a phone call from this guy named Drake. I don't yeah. know if you know who No, he I is. don't know, yeah, no big deal. Um, yeah. And so he calls me, he's like, hey man, listen, I'm putting on this show, nobody knows about it yet, mm -hmm. we haven't announced it, mm -hmm. it's like a kickoff to OVO weekend, would you be interested in doing it? And I was like, yeah, of course, man, I'd love to do it, I'll be there for you. Um, but I didn't think what happened was gonna happen, yeah. you know? So I do the show, and the people, the crowd just goes wild. Mm -hmm. The room erupts, and I'm like, hmm, maybe people actually do still care about Sean Desmond, because yeah. I really didn't think they did. Really, yeah. Um, and I come off stage, and he comes bolting through the door and he grabs me and I'm like, oh man, what did I do? Yeah. And he's like, yo, Sean Desmond, you're different, eh, bro? And I was like, different? I'm like, Drake, I don't know what that means. What are you talking about? <laughs> that sounds like what my mom says when she doesn't like me. Right? Yeah, that's yeah, yeah. different. That's different, uh, yeah. And I'm like, what is that? And he's like, did you hear those people? Did you see them? They love you. Those songs, they are timeless. They're living on. What's happening? And I was like, Drake, I just, I lost the passion and love yeah. for music. Mm -hmm. And it just... I, it wasn't fun anymore. And he's like, yeah, I get that that happens. But he's like, listen to me. Those people need you. Sean Desmond needs to make music again. Yeah. And here I am. A year later, things have been, this year has been absolutely crazy. Mm -hmm. um, Maniac was the first single that we put out that was a top 10 radio uh, radio uh, song. Amazing. It was incredible. And yeah. now Love Me With The Lights On is, 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 on, mm -hmm. is, is out. And I'm just like... I'm just gonna ride this wave. That's amazing. When you're on stage, when you were at OVO Fest mm -hmm. and you were performing, do you actually hear people? I sometimes kind of go like, lose everything, yeah. I kind of black out. <laughs> so I hear people-ish because I have in-ear yeah. monitors. Yeah, yeah, so yeah. I'm really just hearing me, myself and the music, mm -hmm. but I could feel the energy. You know when you can just feel an energy? Yes. I felt it. You felt the room. Yeah, That's I amazing. Room. Yeah. So your wife, Chantel. Yes. And you have three kids. three kids. I hear that she gave you the okay though to get back into the industry. She did. So that night, mm -hmm. we got in the car. See, I'm one that like, I do my job and I'm not like, I don't hang around yeah. and stuff. So we get in the car, the three of us, sorry, the four of us. Mm -hmm. And she turns to me and she said, she's like, babe, I don't think you realize what you did in that room tonight. Mm -hmm. And I was like, really? She said, yeah. She's like, I know it's been hard the last, you know, few years with mm -hmm. me being sick and you just having to kind of like, you know, be the dad, be the husband. Mm -hmm. She's like, but I feel the universe is telling you something, you need to do it. And I needed that from her, honestly. Yeah. Not just Drake, but I needed her to be okay with me. Because when you commit to doing, as you know, when you commit to doing something, especially in the entertainment industry, You're there's in. a lot that comes with that. A hundred percent. So there's a lot of sleepless nights. There's a lot of I'm away and mom is just home with the kids by herself. Mm -hmm. So I needed that from her and I got it. And I was like, let's go. Let's do it. Let's honestly, do it. I think that's so amazing. Thank you. You've got three kids. Do you have, do you have any teenagers yet? I, oh yeah, I have a teen. My oldest is gonna be 15 in 15? like two weeks. Oh my yeah. gosh. Yep. Mustache. Oh. So, <laughs> taller than me. Oh my gosh. Like, yeah. and, but my kids are so great. They're good, they're genuinely good kids. Yeah. Um, you know, and what's so cool is I now get to share this with them, Mary. Yeah. Like where before, my 15 year old, um, 
was maybe like four years old mm -hmm. when I, I kind of had my last hurrah, yeah. I guess. So he was really young. But now it's like, it's cool because they get to see like, oh, my dad was a big deal mm -hmm. and like still kind of is a big yeah, deal. Yeah, they get to see you that. You know, they get to see it. My son, Owen, mm -hmm. got invited by one of, wasn't even really his friend, to mm -hmm. a birthday party. And mm -hmm. the kid said, hey, I want to invite you to my birthday party because my mom wants to meet Sean Desmond. <laughs> Okay. Chantel was like, well, Honestly. I'm going to bring him to the birthday party and tell your mom Sean Desmond's not coming. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my gosh. I love it. Well, I think it's so great, too. You're writing music now because I feel like you're a family man. I am. You're writing music that has meaning. And yeah. Love Me With The Lights On has such a great kind of meaning to it. it it's does. got that uh, telling everybody to just be comfortable with the things mm -hmm. that you're insecure mm -hmm. about because it makes you beautiful. 100%. For mm -hmm. those of you guys that don't know, so my wife suffered from ulcerative colitis mm -hmm. for five years mm -hmm. and it got to the point where medication was not doing anything. It wasn't maintaining it. So she had to have emergency surgery and I'm talking like a month before Maniac came out. Wow. So, so much going on and we were in the hospital. I was laying in the hospital bed with her and she turned and she said to me, Babe, I'm so scared. And I said, of course you're scared. You're going in for major surgery. You should be scared. And she said, no, no, that's not what, what's scaring me. She's like, I'm scared that once I do this surgery and you see the changes in my body, you're not going to find me attractive anymore. Mm -hmm. And I was like, whoa, whoa, whoa. First of all, pause. Your health is first. Yeah. Second of all, you have nothing to worry about. Yeah. You are always going to be the most sexy and most beautiful woman in the room to me. Yeah. So she lives with an ostomy bag now, mm -hmm. but it's like her quality of life is back. Her yeah. life has changed. She's got her life back. And that's what's important. So Love Me With The Lights On was written for her, but mm -hmm. also for anybody out there who's yeah. ever felt insecure, uh, self-conscious about anything about themselves. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I don't care what it is, but we all feel like that sometimes. And my message is embrace those things, mm -hmm. embrace those imperfections, and love me with the lights on because I want to see all those imperfections because they make you perfect. Oh, I love that. And speaking of insecurity, I'm about to attempt something that I've Are never you? done on national TV. Okay. Sean Desmond, will you teach me how to dance I'll a little bit? I'll teach you bit? some moves. Okay, let's do okay, it. Okay, yeah. let's do it. All right. I came dressed for this today, too. You I are ready. Like. I did not. <laughs> yeah. We're not going to do anything too, too crazy, okay. okay? But I know you're a fan of Night Like This. Oh, right? my gosh. So Who it. isn't? So, so there good. are, like, two key moments in that video that are really cool, mm -hmm. right? So there's one. The chorus, it goes, makes me want to say, hey. So you're just pointing. And okay. then step with your left foot. Other hand. Hey. Okay. Two more times. <laughs> hey. Yeah. So that's easy, right? Okay, I can do that. Okay, so yeah. let's try that with no music. Okay, so we okay. go. Makes me wanna say, hey, yeah, yeah. There you go. Okay, okay, right? okay, I got it. Okay, <laughs> now, this next one, this is kind of like the signature move that everybody knows in the night mm -hmm. like this video. So we turn to the side, mm -hmm. our elbows up. Mm -hmm. okay? Oh, I love an elbow. Right? Mm -hmm. So what we're doing is, we're kind of like you're changing gears. So this is the motion with your arm. Okay. So push it out, push it in, uh -huh. out, in. Uh -huh. But at the same time, you're going, uh. Oh, shoot. That's hey. what we do. Oh, okay. Hey. Okay. <laughs> hey. Now try that faster. Ready? Oh. Five, six, seven, eight. Boom, ba, ba, boom, ba, ba, oh, boom, shoot. ba, ba, boom. Okay. There you go. <laughs> yes. I love it. That's good. That's actually not bad, man. Are we going to give it a go with the music? Were you a dancer in your past life before did, you learned how to cook? I baton. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Can we try that with music now? Let's give it a go. Yeah? Okay. 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 Want to cue it up? Was so much fun. I love this for you. You are amazing. Thank you. You are going to kill it on this show. Thank like, you. I love it. I'm so, so excited. Great. Honestly, so stay with us. We'll be right back. I'm going to keep trying to get hey, this. Hey, 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 I'm gone. Hey, hey, I'm gone. Hey, 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 <laughs> Mary here. What did you think? Drop your comments below and don't forget to like and subscribe for more of the good stuff.